Um, hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of review video and I'll be reviewing the Mixed Presto Coffee Maker, which I have it right here. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying new and different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more review videos, there'll be links in the description box below. So this is the Mixpresso 2-in-1 single cup coffee maker. And actually there's a 14 ounce uh, coffee uh, coffee mug included, which I don't have it anymore. I think I threw it away. So this is, uh, I have used this for about almost two years. And, uh, you know, uh, I bought a new coffee maker, which, uh, you know, I'll be reviewing shortly. So the reason I'm doing review of this is because, you know, uh, there's nothing wrong with the product. Uh, this is a very, uh, you know, portable and uh, small and low cost uh, coffee maker. And I uh, like uh, it has served me for a long time. So I would just like to show you, you know, how to make coffee. And I would like to provide my opinions on this. So on this channel, all the reviews are non-affiliated, unbiased and honest. Uh, there's no links to, you know, affiliated links or anything to make money off you. So you're going to hear what is the real yeah, review uh, because uh, uh, there's no, I didn't take money from anyone and I have no interest to, you know, make anyone to purchase by telling uh, good things which are not actually true. So the reason I got, I'm getting rid of this, you know, and I bought a new coffee because I accidentally, I uh, trashed the filter so right now it doesn't have any filter as you can see that this is just this bucket and uh, you know anytime i make coffee or tea uh, it's giving a lot of hard time and also this is very small uh, like you know one cup uh, coffee only so you cannot make more than that so i switch to a one to five cup coffee maker so what we're going to do you can actually uh, make uh, also tea with this one uh, so i'm just going to show you you know today uh, how uh, i make tea but you know you can make coffee and uh, because i don't have any uh, filter anymore so i would just like you know put the tea bag in here so the operation is very simple all you have to do is you know pour water right in here and then you have to just turn the switch on which is right here so one thing i found a little bit difficult that the space kind of is very tight so when you're pouring water uh, it might just like you know spill uh, so let's just take a uh, cup of water and i'm going to put it in here so you can see that, you know, if you like, you know, uh, shake your hands or if you kind of miss, then you're going to spill water. So that's one thing I don't like. And then, you know, if you have, uh, if you want to put coffee or tea, so all you have to do is just put it in here. Uh, although, uh, you know, there's no filter, but this work uh, just works fine. So I'll just put tea here and then I'm going to close the lid. And then you have to put the coffee cup or tea cup in here. Then you have to just turn this off. Then it would make a very uh, a nice cup of coffee. Uh, so let's just, you know, press it here. And you can see that the light is lit and it's blue. So that means that uh, it's working. So it's going to just take a few uh, seconds to warm up the water and start, uh, you know, making coffee or tea. So I have no complaint about this product. It's, uh, you know, very... Uh, nice product and it's a uh, portable and handy so you know it's not uh, heavy at all and this is just good for one cup of coffee uh, you cannot make more than that uh, but you know it served me a long time and if i had to buy this type of coffee maker again i wouldn't mind buying the same thing again and still it works but you know i have another coffee maker that's why i'm not going to be using this anymore so you can see that it started uh, making a uh, tea and it's just uh, one thing I can tell that is slightly slow. It takes a little bit time to finish uh, the whole brewing cycle. Uh, so you have to have a little bit of uh, patience, but you know, that's not a big deal. And once uh, you're done, uh, the switch is just going to be turned off and it's going to go like, you know, a no, it's going to be uh, no light here. And then that means that, you know, your uh, coffee or tea has finished brewing and then you can enjoy your uh, cup of tea or coffee so this is the brewing and uh, sound or brewing, brewing noise which i like a lot so kind of like you know enjoy the whole process of uh, making the coffee or tea it's not not just you know drinking coffee or tea i just like you know uh, hear the noise and wait and uh, you know uh, wait until the final result and then mixing the coffee with cream and sugar so it's just the whole process i like 
and uh, definitely this is a very you know uh, good coffee maker for one person or one cup So you can see that uh, the light is not on anymore so that means it's, it's finished brewing but it's going to kind of like you know drip a little bit for a few seconds because you know the remaining water and you can see that it kind of kind of gets noisy at the end of the process but which is okay okay so it looks like it's done so here uh, you can see that here's the cup of uh, tea and you'd make coffee uh, following the same process uh, but uh, you have to have the you know mesh filter uh, but overall I'm happy with the product and I have uh, really nothing to complain about except like you know the mouth or here where you part the water is a little bit like you know tight but it's, that's not a big deal because this is a small machine but you know it works fine and had never problem or never issue no issues this is the mix presser ultimate two in one single cup coffee maker and i don't have the you know travel mug uh, which was 14 ounce came with it but uh, you do get a travel mug if you buy this so that's all for today thank you for watching this video there will be more videos coming up so i'll see you shortly